What's up, everybody, man? It's your boy, Mr. Dugar, coming at y'all with another video, man. <laughs> and today, man, I'm going to talk about LSU redshirt sophomore cornerback Adarius Greedy Williams has decided to declare for the 2019 NFL Draft and forego playing in the um, Tostitos Fiesta Bowl versus UCF. While meanwhile, junior linebacker Devin White hasn't made a decision on the NFL yet, but we all assume he's going to go. But he's announced that he will play in the Tostitos Fiesta Bowl versus UCF. First, to start off on Greedy, man, I just want, as an LSU fan, I just want to thank him, you know, for his contributions to the team. You know, the last couple of years, man, you know, he's been a pretty solid cornerback for us, man. I remember when I first found out about him when we played BYU in the um in the Superdome last year, the, uh, the season opener, and I remember he got that big interception against BYU. <clears throat> then he was just off and running from there. You know, he was doing his thing. Came into this season, though, like as an All-American. Uh, Mel Kuyper's big boy, he's a projected first-round draft pick at cornerback. You know, the only knock that I have on him, man, I felt like against Alabama and against Texas A&M, you know, he, he gave up some plays, man. You know, in those two games, you know, he got beat. You know what I'm saying? But for the most part, I like his swagger. I like his confidence. You know, he's the latest product out of DBU. I wish him well. Do I wish he was playing in this bowl game? Yeah, I do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I understand, like, this isn't the playoffs, but at the same time, this isn't the flaw of the Boulevard Bowl neither. You know what I'm saying? This is a New Year's Six Bowl, you know, and it's a big deal. But, you know, I, I respect his decision. No knock on him, man. He got to look out. At the end of the day, he got to look out for himself. He got to look out for his future. You know, there's people like Jalen Smith, you know, who's played uh, a bowl game in the New Year's Six Bowl game, in the Fiesta Bowl, matter of fact, you know, against Ohio State when he had that very bad injury and he fell all the way to the second round to the Dallas Cowboys. You know, so I understand that from that standpoint, you don't want to play. Plus, I mean, you know, Leonard Fournette did it a couple of years ago when we was playing Louisville in the, um, I think it was the Citrus Bowl in Orlando. It wasn't a New Year's Six Bowl, but, you know, I respect Greedy's decision, man, and I wish him well, man, uh, to have a good, to have a great uh, combine you know, to get drafted as high as he could possibly get drafted and to have a solid career in the NFL and to really represent DBU, you know. But um, with that being said, also for Devin White, man, I, I, I expect this to be his last game, you know. But I, I want to give a shout-out to Devin White for playing in this game, man, you know, for saying this unfinished finished business. You know, yes, like I said, with Greedy, it's not a playoff game, but this is bigger than the Florida Boulevard, uh, Boulevard game. This is a New Year's Six game. This is LSU's first New Year's Six bowl game since the new college football format, man. You know, we're going up against the team that has the longest win streak in all of college football. You know what I'm saying? Yes, it's not a sexy name. It's not an opponent like a Michigan or somebody like that. You know, but it's, this game is a big deal, man. So I just want to give a shout out to Devin White, man, to Devin White for participating in this game when he could have easily sat out and get ready for the NFL, man. But, um, you know, glad to have both these young men as part of the team, as well as the other seniors, you know, you know, like the Nick Brissett, the Foster Moreau's, you know what I'm saying, the, the John Battles who's injured, you know, um, and a bunch of other seniors, man. I, I don't really had a list of all the seniors in front of me. I'm just going off the ones off the top of my head. You know, this they'll be all their last games in the LSU uniform, man. And um, I just want to thank them for all their contributions, you know, to the Tigers program, man. But um, but with that being said, man, I appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, give me a subscribe, man. I'm going to have LSU content throughout the season. Y'all have a blessed one. Go Tigers.